my top five horror movies of all time. That's right, you heard it, of all time. Like, nothing can top them. And yes, I recently revised this, all right? Here we go, but before we get into it, make sure to follow if you're new here and enjoy horror movies. First up, it is forever gonna go to Pet Cemetery, Stephen King. This movie is depressing, it's sad, it's brilliant, wonderfully written, amazingly acted, everything. This movie contains a scene that I just can never get out of my head, AKA the truck scene with Gage. You guys know exactly what I'm talking about. This was one of the very first horror movies that I saw as a kid. Yes, as a kid, I know. 10 out of 10 easily. Next is The Shining, another Stephen King, directed by Stanley Kubrick. I could watch this movie over and over and still manage to get the chills and goosebumps every time, just simply because of the music, let alone the story. The atmosphere of the hotel and just the way that Jack loses his mind still is scary to me. Rest in peace to Shelley Duvall. Jeepers Creepers. I have to say, I think he is probably my number one villain of all time, aside from Michael Myers. I don't think he gets enough credit. I really don't. I think this movie is so original and truly scary. And this is when I first fell in love with Justin Long. And this movie really, really is chilling, in my opinion. Imagine this creature that comes out every 23rd spring and wants to eat everybody in sight that he smells fear on. Terrifying. And I am throwing in Jeepers Creepers 2 with this one, just because I love that one too. You guys know damn well, The Exorcist is the number one scariest film I've seen, but it now belongs on my top five films of all time for horror. I mean, nothing can really top this for me in terms of possession films. This film is just truly, truly terrifying. And for the time frame that it was filmed in, they did an amazing job with this. I don't care what anybody says about it. And if you guys have been following me for a while, you know damn well my movie, my number one movie is The Others. The plot twist in this film lives in my head rent-free at the end of the film. The movie is depressing, it's traumatic, it's a masterpiece, it's flawless in my opinion. It's wonderfully crafted and it's completely underrated. And the performance by Nicole Kidman in this is unbelievably, unbelievably phenomenal. Honorable mention on my top five goes to The Sixth Sense by M. Night Shyamalan. It was so hard to do this list, guys, but these are my five that I really watch all the time and I can't get enough of. Let me know your top five in the comments. I'm curious. 